So you just missed out on getting another lap in at the end there. Did that compromise you greatly? Um, not really. I mean, luckily nobody else, uh, or, or at least Kobayashi, didn't go out again to set another lap uh, because that would have meant uh, I would have been shy by probably a second, which was a bit stupid. I mean, in the last chicane, everybody was driving so slow, and I, I, I saw my lap and my time, so I, I knew I, I had to go through somehow, otherwise I wouldn't make it, and uh, just missed it by a second. So a bit of a shame, but uh, it didn't make a uh, it didn't make a problem in the end. And since we didn't see what happened on camera with Lewis Hamilton, he didn't make it through either. He was behind you. Can you tell us what happened? Actually, the car, I had Weber in front that slowed down because Hamilton slowed down. I don't know what was in front of him, if he really had to slow down that much. But he was tight for all three of us, so we all had to push somehow to make it uh, through and to uh, may do another lap. And uh, at that moment, I was set to do a lap because I didn't know whether Kobayashi uh, may go out or, or somebody goes out. So. Uh, uh, I tried my best and uh, then Lewis pushed me a little bit wide uh, uh, onto the grass and uh, made it through. <laughs> so a bit of an awkward start of a, of a qualifying lap. Hopefully tomorrow will be a more comfortable race for you. Is your car feeling comfortable out there? It is, yeah. No, it's uh, working out well all weekend. Uh, we, we're going really good and getting uh, the maximum out of the car, so I'm happy.